folks, I'm doing some more Street Fighter 6 combos today. The response to these videos has been really positive, so thank you guys so much for watching. Today, we're going to be doing Kimberly, DJ, and Blanca. These were the most requested characters down in the comments, so make sure to let me know what characters you want to see next. I'm going to do them all, and then I'm going to rank them on this highly scientific list of difficulty. Currently, Guile is the most difficult at a 10, and Lily is the least difficult at a 4. But let's see where these new characters stack up. We're starting out with some Bushin target combos here from Kimberly. Oh, nice. Okay, end it in a throw. Wait, did I do that wrong? Oh, 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 that's a different combo. Okay, that's the one that ends in throw. Okay, for a little side switch action. Two-piece cancel here. It is really crazy that she can special cancel her far medium kick. That is actually such a powerful tool. All right, uh, huh. I don't really know how this move works, which is a real problem for me. When I play this character online, I get owned by that move. I don't really know what to do about it. Uh, oh, oh, during sprint, medium. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, drive impact. Her Tatsu is really, really cool looking. I feel like there have been complaints in this game that a lot of hurricane kicks look a little bit weird, like Ryo and Ken hurricane kicks. They look a little funky, the animation, but hers, I think, looks really, really satisfying. All right, nice. Beginner trials down. Now on to some intermediates. Wow, that's also nice. She can hit confirm off three lights. Lily can do that too. I think it's pretty strong. Oh, link combo off slide. I've seen people having trouble with this. If you guys don't know, the trick to this is you have to hit late. If you hit early, you have like no time. You have to hit late with the with the slide. They put that pretty early for how technical that trial is, I feel like. Oh yeah, link off down medium kick. That's another unique Kimberly thing. You can't cancel her crouching medium kick, but you can link off it. Really cool. And that move with, with Drive Rush, her crouching medium kick becomes, like, insane. It's so plus. Uh, oh, Overhead. Yeah, she also gets a combo off Overhead without having to Drive Rush first. I don't think very many characters get that. She just seems so good. I understand she has issues because she's very, like, high commitment. But she seems really crazy to me. Uh, forward Heavy Kick into Jump. Oh, that actually combos. All right, all right, I'm ready. Yeah, it's easier if you just mash the jab. Maybe it's not actually a link. Is that just a chain? But there's no way you could chain into target combo, right? I don't know. EX. Wow. EX, uh, Azuna drop. Oh, wow, they're like ground bounced. What the heck? That's sick. I didn't know they were like ground bounced after EX Azuna drop. Okay, we're comboing we're comboing off throw here. And then we got to do another air EX Azuna drop. Am I going to have to tiger knee? Oh yeah. Yeah, it's easier if you tiger knee the command grab. So if you guys don't know about tiger kneeing, you do quarter circle forward and then up forward plus punch. So you basically put the jump motion into the into the special move motion. Okay, drive rush. This is what I was talking about. Like being able to drive rush off standing medium kick is so good because the range is really crazy. Oh, and then we end with... Okay, end with command grab. That one also is easier if you tiger knee it. Okay. These have been relatively tricky so far. I will admit. Um, and then we got to go raw into super there. Nice. Not too shabby. Intermediate 10. Wow, she gets a link off Stan Roundhouse. No drive rush. Oh, oh, because... 
because the run is EX, you're allowed to cancel the follow-up. For some reason in my mind, I was like, oh, I'm just pressing one button to do the follow-up. So it's not an EX attack, but no, it totally counts as an EX attack. So you're allowed to cancel EX attacks into level two, of course. Okay, intermediate 11. Oh! Oh my god, we got it, like, first try! Nice. The only hard part about that one is doing the, the early drive rush, but I talked about that in earlier trials. If you hold the parry button during the animation, you'll get it on, like, the first possible frame. Uh, okay, corner combo. Oh, we have to do sprint into heavy. What? This is this is like a, a run stop combo for real. Oh my god. Oh! I did the wrong version of Hurricane Kick. There we go. Okay. That one is pretty tricky just because it's a lot of inputs really fast. It's kind of hard to keep them all straight in your hands. All right, so this is another, I, I always find these so weird. I mean, I get the point of the combo, like you can catch someone neutral jumping from half screen away, which is in theory, pretty powerful. But uh, it's hard for me to imagine me landing this in a match. It just seems so hard. Oh, that's cool. That's a really cool looking combo. That's way easier than advanced one. Damn. Okay. Uh, so this is like a janky tiger knee, right? Let me let me watch the let me watch the example. I'm pretty sure we have to do a janky tiger knee here. Yeah. So what I mean by that, <laughs> what I mean by a janky tiger knee is essentially we do quarter circle back and then we do up forward plus kick. Because the thing is, you can't do this with a back jump. It only works during forward jump. So you have to do a little bit of a trick there. And you can also see it's it's different from just doing light Tatsu. Light Tatsu operates in a different way. You see, you don't get that hit on the way down. So this seems quite hard as well, I must say. Oh, I'm I'm getting it already, guys. Let's go. There we go. Ah, then I just have to believe. I just have to believe that it's going to work off the ground bounce. No, oh, I was too slow on the super. Ah, I'm panicking at the very end. That's gotta be it. That's it. Okay, okay. That one, the only tricky part is the instant air tatsu. Once you know how to do that, that one's not super hard. All right, let's just work on the last part. By the way, if you're ever struggling with combo trials, I think that the biggest thing you can do to improve is breaking it up into chunks. So I'm not even gonna worry about the first three lines. We're just gonna do everything after that. Oh, does that, that, must special cancel because it's an EX. Yeah. Wow, that's so cool. So this is like her easiest combo of the advanced ones, to be honest. Yeah, that one that one is really simple. So it's nice that <laughs> they throw one easy one in here. Compared to the last two, that was pretty simple. But it looks like we're getting hard again. Okay, punish counter heavy. So this is just an easy way to tack on damage at the front because you leave Ryu standing the whole time. These first two hits are basically like free. There, okay, okay, that's not that hard actually. This one like feels really hard, but it's pretty simple or it's, it's, it's not simple, it's complicated. 
but the uh, the execution is not very hard. Oops. Okay. Let's go. All right. Assuming that was her last one, I thought that uh, Kimberly was somewhat tricky, but I feel like it's deceptive. It, it seems a lot harder than it is because everything has like a ton of inputs and like a lot of buttons really fast, but none of them have hard timing. So uh, we'll, we'll give her her final score at the end with everyone else, but she was not crazy hard, but she definitely wasn't easy. So next up, DJ. I've heard DJs are really fun, so let's jump in here. So I played DJ a couple of times, but I don't know like his combos or anything really. Oh, I see. He has a follow up there. Oh, he has an air target combo? He gave my boy some sauce. Let's go. Yeah, medium, uh, medium, uh, Sobot kick. Seems really nice now that it's a motion move. You can use it, like, whenever you want in combos. Damn. So this links, huh? Whoa. I'm s oh, oh, it has to be juggle, I bet. That's how they get you, man. That's how they get you. I figured it out, though. Exact same deal as before. All right. Easy ones were very easy. All right, all right. We have to do the jump light kick a little low in the jump to make that easier. Um... This is a, a DJ classic here. He's been able to do that since Super Turbo. In a way, DJ kind of feels like one of the more like traditional characters in this. Like he has links that feel like Street Fighter 4 links. A lot of characters, their links feel a lot more limited unless you use Drive Rush. That's interesting. There we go. I see. So like the first hit of EX Just Cool launches them. So the the follow up is kind of guaranteed. Okay. So this is another one where you need to hold parry to get the instant the instant drive rush there. Nice. Oh, this is another one like that. Whoa. I'm mashing too hard. I'm mashing too hard. Okay, let's go. Am I really struggling on intermediates, guys? Not like this. Yeah, this move is so plus, right? This seems like one of his best normals for sure. I know it's vulnerable to drive impact, but it's crazy. Oh, got him. Okay, nice. Woo! All right, it's time to find out, does the white boy have rhythm, guys? Let me just try this by itself. Pfft. Sir? Sir? Okay, how do I time this? Oh, 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 oh. I'm so stupid. I was doing light, light. But the first light is just activating the super. I'm so dumb. All right, we got a first try. <laughs> after after realizing that it's light, medium, heavy, not light, light, medium, heavy, I got it first try. Okay, okay. The white boy does have rhythm, guys. Contrary to what you might think. See? Easy. Easy money. <laughs> Why? Just <laughs> quit writing your comments, guys. I know I'm getting roasted down there. I know I'm for sure getting roasted, but put the comments away, guys. <laughs> It just looks painful, man. When you're getting you're getting m massaged like that, you're get, you're getting completely tenderized. So, it, oh no, this doesn't require charge trickery because you can hold back. You can hold back while you do medium kick. Ooh, close. 
He's got some very cool combos. I really, really like what they've done to DJ in this game. Wow, he can combo off punish counter level one? Uh. Oh, wait, do I not actually have rhythm? Wait a minute. If I do, if I do it with better timing. I, I missed it earlier somehow. Wait, what am I missing here? Yeah, see, I, I missed the rhythm there. So I don't get the music notes. Oh, I see. There actually is a level of difficulty to it. Yeah, yeah, see. Oh, no, I'm dropping the rhythm. Ah, uh, too fast, too fast. Too slow, too slow. Oh my gosh. Okay, you can continue writing your comments about how the white boy has no rhythm. Alright, feel free, feel free to write them, guys. Listen, I was a drummer for like 20 years of my life. Him. Okay, 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 okay. It's not actually that hard, guys. It's not actually that hard. I'm just panicking. The pressure is too much for me. During just cool launch. This one's really easy. This does not seem to merit being a, an advanced three. Unless I'm missing something. No, I think I think I got it. Yeah, this this, this seems pretty easy for an advanced three. Oh, that was it? All right. The only hard thing about DJ's combos is keeping up the rhythm. <laughs> That's the only part that actually was kind of tricky. But I feel like once you get consistent with that, his combos are actually pretty easy. So that's nice. Once again, I'll give him a number score at the end. But let's move on to Blanca. Last one for today. Oh, I've already done a bunch of Blancas, but I don't think I've done his advance. I'll just go through these all uh, quickly. Just to show you guys if you haven't seen them. And then the advanced ones will all be new to me, so. Electricity. I, I don't know how I feel about um, electricity being emotion instead of mash. I understand that it's a lot easier for, like, pad players and stuff. But I just like the charm of having to mash electricity, you know? I just think it's fun. Woof. Woof. Slap him down. I feel like Blanca's attacks look really, really satisfying in this game. They look like super beefy. It, he reminds me of Street Fighter 2 Blanca more than anything. Like in Street Fighter 2 Blanca, he was like a bruiser. He was not like a, like a rushdown mix-up like... Uh, trickster character. He was like almost a grappler. He was he was like super heavy, massive damage with his bite throw. Uh, and obviously his playstyle is not really like that, but like his animations and stuff remind me of that in this. And like even his walk cycle, like just looks so beefy. Oh, we got to start charging during the coward crouch. There we go. Uh, counter hit. Oh, yeah. I see everyone do this online. There we go. Yeah, you can't actually cancel standing heavy kick, right? So it's got to be a link. Okay, forward. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, and then we got it. Whoa. This is an interesting one. We got to start holding charge. What the heck? Oh, oh, I I think we have to do 
We have to do jump back to make that work. There it is. Yeah, jump back makes that work because you can hold charge. Okay, punish counter Blanca Ball. Oh, yeah, that's the online special. You get them rolling from the punish counter. That's so cool. This normal seems really good to me. You can do like shimmies and then hit them from like so far away with this. Wow, that barely works. Okay. Wow! Three balls and one combo. That's sick. Are you, clearly, I've done these intermediate ones already, but I've completely forgotten about them. I've done so many combos in the meantime. Oh, almost. Oh, almost. There she is. Wait, what? I did the wrong move somewhere. Oh, it's supposed to be medium punch, not medium kick. Personally, I would do medium kick there, but I guess medium punch probably has faster startup, so... Oh, it has more range. Oh, I see. So, yeah, that might actually be better. Okay. This was the... This is the first one I haven't done yet for him. Uh, how about we watch the demo? What do you say? Oh my god. This looks really complicated, but I think it might not be that bad. Bruh! <laughs> This has got to be one of the hardest intermediates in the game, right? Most intermediates are not very difficult for me, but this one is... This one is really tripping me up. Oh, it has to be punch. I'm pressing kick to do the follow-ups. Oh. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, rolling attack or uh, rainbow roll. I don't know if that's the real name. That's what we always used to call it. I was too early even. You actually have to delay a little bit. There we go. That's a cool combo. Not that hard either. That one's really cool. Uh-oh. Install time. Wait. Huh? Uh, Alright. We're going to need to see a demo for this. This is so misleading. They don't tell you that you have to block a ball down. Yeah, you have to you have to go down after it hits so that you you have time. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this looks hard, man. There. Whoa! Why did that work? I'm so bad at that coward crouch part. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Woo -hoo -hoo. That one was pretty tricky, man. That was pretty tricky. That took me a good, I don't know, five, ten minutes, maybe. Yo. All right. I'm just going to watch the demo for this. This looks crazy. You put out Blanca Chan, jump in. Okay, so we pretty much, the important part is we have to make sure that we wait for Blancachon to launch him towards me before we do EX Rainbow Roll. That seems like the most important part. Oh, I think we might have actually been a little early there.
please. Please? Okay, we got it. Well, that one's not that hard. It looks really hard, but it's pretty much just timing out the rainbow rolls is the hard part. And we're done! Only three advanced for Blanca, too. Man, all right. I'm happy. That was really fun. Really, really fun. All right, so if I pull up our list here. So to start out with, Kimberly, I think, was probably the hardest one today. Uh, I think I'm going to give her a seven. I don't think she's quite as hard as... Cammy and JP, but she's on par with Chun. I would say she's probably slightly harder than Chun. DJ was honestly pretty easy, except for his level two super. That's really the only tricky thing, like whatsoever for him. Uh, I think I'll give him a six. Some of his intermediates were a little tricky as well, so I'll put him a little bit above Ryu. And then Blanca, I think I'm also gonna put at a seven. Uh, he had like two hard combos. It was the ones that involve his install. Those were both pretty tricky, but like if I look at how much time they took me, uh, they probably took me less than five minutes each. So if we compare it to like JP, one of his combos took me forever, so he was really hard. And uh, no one has quite cracked up here with Guile yet, but we'll see if anyone can come close later. But once again, uh, thank you guys for suggesting these characters and let me know again what characters you want to see next. We got all these guys left down here, so uh, I would love to hear your thoughts. Oh, sorry, all these guys. All these guys here are still available, so uh, let me know who I should do next. Looks like we probably got two or three videos worth of trials left to go. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good one.